Hi everybody, it's Carl Eric here and uh, today I'm gonna show you how to add lightning to a sky video that you took or anything like that. It's pretty simple, there's a few steps but uh, it's not that hard. So first uh, import your, your footage, I've got mine here, I took a video of the sky one day so here it is. Then uh, you can go in media generators and in the noise texture you go down and there's something called lightning. So you take that, you drag it under your video, the new track. All right, and you can change the color here but uh, it's not needed. Yellow is good. So you don't want it too big. Just bring it where you want it to and uh, uh, make it a few seconds. In my case, now it's five seconds. I'll make it two seconds. Three seconds. All right. All right. So mine is three seconds. Then you want to go in. The Compositing mode. Click on that. Make it a hard light right here. And uh, you want to take this and you want to make add. So both can can fit. All right. Then you're gonna click on your lightning. So you see it. And you want to go here and track motion. And you're gonna control it make it smaller or bigger in your intentions and you're gonna bring it to where you want in my case I'll just bring it here maybe hitting the tree or something I go up my come on like this not too big right here it's a start then uh We'll change the settings for this. You want to go in the uh, event pan crop. Uh, actually, not now. Just go in generated media. And uh, you want to play with these settings. Play with uh, the here the noise uh, parameters. See which which kind of settings you like. Make it thicker, smaller. Change the color. Uh, some stuff like that. All right, then when you're done uh, doing all your settings, you want to go at the end here, down here in the key line thingy, go to the end, and uh, you want to go in the progress here let's say we'll we'll move it from 0 to about 3 yeah 3.1 is good and it's going to create a keyframe so from now on it's going to be like a small clip a small moving video actually that looks a bit too long we're going to put it down for to about a second like this and yeah, that, that looks good, that looks good. All right, now, uh, you're gonna create another video track. And in that video track, you're gonna go in media generators again, uh, solid colors, and you're gonna take the white color. Great, leave it white, all the settings are perfect and size it down so it's as big as the lightning then uh, with that you're gonna go here again in compositing mode and you're gonna put it on add and we're gonna level to about 25 percent 24 no oh, no too low 24% that's perfect 
after that going track motion no not track motion not yet not yet sorry um in uh, event pan crop that's the one and you're gonna press on mask and you want the second tool here the Antor creation tool and uh, you're gonna create something that looks like when you have your lightning something that would surround it so um, doesn't matter how big it is but uh, just make it look like it's surrounding a lightning thing like that and at the end you wanna make it close like a spike like this so if you look you'll have this now and that looks pretty cool pretty cool and then now you're gonna go in track motion size it down and uh, actually a bit more up like this and place it on top doesn't matter if it's bigger or not as big or anything and then we are going to go in generated media no we're not actually it's in here event pan crop and we are gonna go in the feather type and select both and I think we're gonna go with 10 so just type in 10 enter so you see it's it's slider so it's gonna blend in with the other colors and stuff so you see here it's like a light that appears because of the lightning so it's right there we're gonna size it down a bit oh yeah no, 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 that's that's better just like that you see then there's one more step to make it cooler we can put sound effects which I don't see why we wouldn't uh, for thunder sound effects I will put in the descriptions of this video some uh, websites where you can find some where I found mine actually so uh, I'm gonna go get mine and uh, here it is place it and uh, this one's big so just you want to find where and what part you want to use of it I'm gonna use the end so it's not too too big and uh, me what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place it about uh, one third in the small lightning thing so it's it's like an offset of the sound because it's far away so uh, that's nice and you want it, you want it to keep going after so it's more realistic and yeah so here's a uh, how to add lightning to videos and uh, you can make some of your your own post uh, responses to to show me your your awesome work and comment rate and please subscribe